All right, guys, this is Brandon from Heartland Marine. Today we're looking at a Fisher deck boat I traded for. It's 2003. It's got a 4.3 liter 190 horse Merc. It does come with a tandem axle trailer matching. It's got a nice bimini top, big full cover. The graphics are a little edgy. The boat itself's in good shape. You can always put new stickers on it, peel these off. That'll really make it look, you know, brand new. Doesn't cost a whole lot to paint these either. The slider's nice. It was made for the boat. The trailer's made for the boat. Sorry if I'm stuttering, stammering. I got a head cold. Mother Nature won't make up her mind. But the hole's in great shape. And again, the paneling, like the sides, are all nice. It's not beat up, dinged up, scratched up. It's been used in deep water. It's got your swim steps back here. Okay. Let's go jump inside and take a look. All right, now we're inside this Fisher deck boat. So the interior is nice overall. We do got a few little things that we can fix back here. A couple little lips to, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> loop stitches on the stem pad. But the vinyl is nice, great. We got to fix the ladder. Got some nicks in the back seat I have on right there. But outside of that, it's in great shape. Captain seat's nice, helm's nice. Storage down here, storage in the helm. And I put those everywhere, storage underneath all these seats. Now it's got two fishing chairs. Um, it's got a really nice big full cover. Now the extension pole for both fishing chairs are underneath this. It's got a 70 pound thrust Makota V2 power drive trolling motor. That's where our lights plug in, that's where our trolling motor plugs in. The foot pedal's up there also. To the port side, tons of seating for lots of family and friends. And storage underneath all these seats if you fill up all these seats ma'am sir you just have too much stuff <laughs> so <laughs> back here's where your other fishing seat stores and they got storage underneath that it is powered well 4.3 merc so 190 horse the boats are locked don't weigh that much it's great about this too if you got a light tow capacity this style of boat gives you the most room with very little weight to tow behind you. So with 190 horse, this thing will actually really get up and go. Well, I did my video in reverse. Now I'm gonna do the outside and then put it in first. So if you have any questions, call Brandon Johnson at Heartland Marine. Thanks for looking.